In this video, we will learn how to install OpenCV library in Anaconda. So I will show you two different ways to install OpenCV. The first one is through Anaconda Navigator and the second one is through the Anaconda prompt or the terminal. So now this is my Anaconda Navigator and to install OpenCV, first of all, we will click on this environments and now here we will see all the environments which we have created through Anaconda. So here first we will create a virtual environment for our project because it is recommended to have a separate virtual environment for each of the project. So we will also create the virtual environment first and then we will install the OpenCV library inside that created environment. But in case you already have the virtual environment created for your project, then you can skip the creation part and select the environment from this list and then install the OpenCV library inside that environment. So now to create the virtual environment, first we will click on this create then this dialog box will come up and here we will give the name of the virtual environment so i will type opencv underscore env so this is the name of the virtual environment which we want to create here now from here we can select the programming language and this python will be selected already and from this drop down we can change the version of the python so whatever version we will select from here it will install that particular version in this new environment so for now i will keep this selected and now finally click on this create. So now the environment is being created. Let's wait for some time here. And now it is loading some base packages in this environment. So finally it is finished now and we can see our environment in this list. Now here this environment is already selected for me. But if in case it is not selected for you then click on this and select this environment manually otherwise the OpenCV library would not be installed in this environment. And after selecting this we will click on this drop down and here by default this installed option will be selected already which means that these are the libraries which are currently installed in this selected environment. And now we will search for OpenCV in this search option. And here we can see that we did not get anything in the search result because this OpenCV library is not installed currently in this selected environment. So now we will again click on this drop down and this time we will select this not installed option. So as soon as we selected this not installed option we can see all the libraries here which has OpenCV in the either in the name or in the description. And this is the OpenCV library which we want to install here. So we will select this from here and click on this apply. Now we will get this type of dialog box which is saying that one package will be modified and 66 packages will be installed. And here I will scroll down to the last then we will see this OpenCV library. So this is the main library which we want to install and the others are the dependent library of this OpenCV. So that's why they are marked with this star. And here also it is written that this star indicates that the package is a dependency of the selected package. And now finally we will click on this apply which will start our installation. And now this is installed successfully and it took quite some time for me around 2 to 3 minutes. So you need to be patient here. And now let's verify the installation. So for that we will again click on this drop down and select this installed. And here we already have this OpenCV written. So this time we can see this OpenCV library in this search results which was not present earlier. So this is the evidence that this OpenCV is installed successfully in this selected environment. Now we will see the another way of installing OpenCV which is through Anaconda prompt or the terminal. So if you are using Windows then it would be the Anaconda prompt and in case of Mac it will be terminal. So now I will open the terminal because for my case it is the Mac system. Now when you open the terminal or the Anaconda prompt the base environment will be already activated. And now to install OpenCV here also first we will create one virtual environment and then we will install the OpenCV library inside that created environment. So to create the environment we will type here conda space create space hyphen hyphen name then space and now we will type the name of the virtual environment which we want to create. So let's say this is OpenCV underscore new env and now we will again give space and at the last we will type python equals to and the version of the python which we want to install in this new environment. So I will type 3.13 because this is the latest version as of now and here this python argument is not mandatory it is option but it is a best practice to provide this argument and the suitable python version and finally we will hit enter so here it is saying that it will install these many packages so we will say y here and hit enter so finally it is completed now and our environment should be created. So let's verify that and for that we will list down all the environments which are managed by Anaconda. So we will type 
conda space env space list and hit enter so here we can see that our new environment is also present in this list which was this opencv underscore new env so it means our environment is created successfully so far so good now we will activate this environment but before that let me clear the terminal once so that it would be better visible to you and now to activate this environment we will type conda space activate space and the name of the environment so which was opencv underscore new env and hit enter so as soon as the command is executed we will see this opencv underscore new env within these brackets so this is the evidence that that this particular environment is currently activated and now finally we will install the opencv library in this activated virtual environment so for that we will type pip install then space opencv hyphen python and hit enter and once this is installed we will see this message of successful installation and now to verify the installation let's print all the libraries that are currently installed in the current activated environment which is this opencv underscore new env so we, for that we will type conda space list and here we will see this opencv library as well which has this particular version and now we will quickly try to import this opencv library in the python shell so for that we will type python here and hit enter so we are now in the python shell and now we will import the opencv library so we will type import space cv2 so the import is successful without any error but it took quite some time around one minute for me and now we will also print the version of opencv so we will type print then cv2 dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore and hit enter so here we have got the version also of this opencv library which is same as this one so this is the evidence that opencv is installed successfully in our environment now let me know in comments if this video was useful to you and make sure to hit the like button and for free courses you can also refer the video description